Hello and welcome to Paris for EuroPCR 2016. It is my pleasure to be joined here by the course directors, Jean Fagedet and William Wines. Jean, my first question to you. What will be the key topics this year at EuroPCR 2016? Oh, this year there will be uh, several key topics. The first one should be certainly TAVI. Uh, the second uh, will be the stroke prevention mm -hmm. uh, using the left atrial appendage closure or the carotid stenting in order to prevent the stroke. The third and the fourth will be certainly coronary in the coronary field with uh, treatment of uh, left main disease and uh, a large uh, uh, session on the uh, recanalization of chronic total occlusions. Fantastic, so some excellent topics to be discussed. And perhaps William, if I may ask, what do you think the role of imaging is in these topics in 2016? Great question, thank you. I guess the key word is integration. Imaging is now an integral part of procedural interventions, both for structural work, treatment planning of TAVI, and also during the procedure. Yeah. Same for coronary work. Intravascular imaging is integrated in the um, angiographic uh, roadmap. Mm -hmm. And we can really state today, like Dr. Piazza said yesterday, imaging techniques are the eyes of the heart team. And of course, there is so much innovation available to us. But what do you think is particularly innovative this year at EuroPCR 2016? Well, we have a wealth of communications about um, late-breaking trials, innovation, new techniques, we have 900 abstracts with um, presentation of uh, scientific data, and I think that's very important. Now, if one topic stands out with respect to innovation, I think it is interventional treatment of mitral and tricuspid valve disease. And Jean, for me, the live cases are a big part of EuroPCR. Can you tell me what makes the live cases at EuroPCR so special? Uh, first of all, there will be, uh, what you say, a large part of uh, uh, the meeting uh, to give uh, shortly some figures. It's, that should present uh, more than uh, 50 uh, uh, live cases, more than 50 hours of uh, live transmissions, and this coming from uh, 13 selected centres. What is unique in the EuroPCR, it's the, the preparation. The preparation is unique because the, the a live demonstration is not a show for, just for the show. A live demonstration is to really focus on uh, one or two objectives. It could be for the peripheral uh, field, uh, uh, structural, coronary, or uh, stroke prevention. What is unique is the way to prepare. In other words, we have a group of uh, uh, operators, within, and during the, the last uh, month, uh, following the, the, the meeting, we have the preparation in order to have, you know, a sort of uh, homogeneity in the live transmission in order to really do the best, to give the best educational message, educational way uh, of uh, transmission for uh, all the public here, all the attendees in the Palais des Congrès in Paris. So preparation is key by the sounds of things. And with so much content available to us at EuroPCR this year, what specific formats do we use to maximise the educational potential for attendees? There are uh, different formats, of course, and uh, uh, what's interesting uh, the, this year uh, is that we could have the possibility for the attendees is to select uh, the, each uh, format according to his needs. So it could be a very interactive uh, format, like the sharing centre, to uh, more f uh, formal uh, you know, lecture in the all you need to know uh, session. And in between, you could select your best way. And there is one tool which is fantastic this year and really new, it's the application. In other words, with the three dimension, using the, through the application, you could select your uh, theme or track, you can select the formats of the session, and you can select the focus according to your needs. You could be interested in innovation, in daily practice, uh, or, or you could be a nurse uh, and technician. Everybody could select the best and most interesting session for itself. Wonderful. Well, I'm really excited uh, to get started at EuroPCR this year. 
And perhaps, William, a final word from you to conclude this session on what not to miss at EuroPCR 2016. Thank you, Chris. You know, we're trying to offer a great forum to our colleagues for interaction, learning and networking. But in the end, we would like to wish each participant a great educational journey that they will select by themselves in order to transform their practice for the best outcomes of our patients. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.